obviously a PhD isn't what it used to be. The Loudoun Purdue University has granted a degree to my brother Kyle. Kyle, who tried to do a headstand on a moving skateboard when he couldn't do one on the unmoving ground. Kyle, who rents my cell phone instead of my scuba gear. Who to this day will argue that Steven Tyler was singing Sing Women instead of Sing With Me in the legendary Aerosmith song Dream On. Who has self-inflicted scars from a racquetball racket and a ring of keys. Kyle, who is afraid of spiders but pretends to be Spider-Man. Who secretly watches Laguna Beach. Who sets his emergency break religiously because Greg told Dharma on the CBS hit comedy Dharma and Greg that her transmission was not a parking break. Purdue is giving Kyle a degree for his knowledge of the inner workings of the human body. But here's the kicker. Kyle can't blow his nose. Sure, he tries. He picks up the Kleenex and some air comes out. But unless something is right there on the edge, nothing's doing. I think it might be physics. You know, the whole PV equals NRT thing, where pressure is inversely proportional to volume. The poor fellow's nose is just too big. Oh, and his head is ginormous too. I know that doesn't really go along with my whole Kyle's not as smart as everybody thinks he is theme, but I thought it was worth uh, mentioning nonetheless. Seriously, look at it. It's huge. I really think that Kyle has duped you all, you bunch of boilermakers. But even so, I'm really excited for him. Kyle has found something that he loves to do. I can tell this by how he goes into Bill Nye the Science Guy mode when he talks to me about things like toll-like receptor fours, whatever those are. Or when he explains to me how the electrophenometer or whatever the hell it's called, how that works. Part of me thinks he likes the science of it all, but the other part thinks he's holding out for some lab accident that will give him superhuman powers as his DNA becomes mixed with that of a bug. Probably a cockroach. I've seen the lab in the basement of Lambert. You may all know him as reliable, although occasionally absent-minded Kyle. But I'm proud to say that I am the only one that knows him as Black Man, as Evil Kyle, as a member of the Power Pack team, as Two Tall Jones and Ace Sure Shot, as my big brother. I deeply regret not being there today when Kyle walked across the stage, or now, as you celebrate the long haul that has been Kyle's education. But know that I'm somewhere in the Cambodian jungle, and when I'm not wondering who is going to throw themselves between me and all of those malaria-carrying mosquitoes, I'm wishing I was with you. Thanks. And way to go, black man.